CIL 650 in association with Tom Lucas Productions presents Radio Real Estate. And now, here are your hosts, Sherry Brown and Tom Lucas. And good morning. It's a little after 10 o'clock. Welcome to the On Air Open House. It's Tom Lucas with you, and our brand new co host is in the studio with us today, Fern Northcott. Good morning. How are you? Good morning, Tom. I'm just fine, thanks. How are you? I'm well. Let me check. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm okay. <laughs> so it's you and I in the studio. So the second week you're on the show, they put you in the studio alone with me and Dwayne, of course. Well, that's scary. Yeah, we sent Bill Macklem on special assignment again, and uh, I don't know. I've got him on the phone. Where are you, Bill? I'm up here in sunny Whistler. Oh my God, is it really sunny up there? No, it's not. <laughs> 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 no, now, it's not. I know it's why you're up there. And wet. I know why you're up there, Bill, but tell our listeners why you're up in Whistler this morning, or actually this weekend for the past couple of days. We're here for the uh, National Dominion Lending Center's uh, annual or semi annual conference. So they had uh, close to uh, 600 uh, brokers and owners uh, attending this uh, event. It's been uh, quite eventful, I'll tell you that. So is it brokers just from British Columbia or from all across uh, North America? From all across uh, Canada. I was wow. talking to people from uh, Burlington, and they were quite happy to be here. And uh, unfortunately, they're uh, leaving uh, today, and it's going to be sunny on Monday. Now, the president of the company is in town, too. We were going to try to get him on the phone, but he's busy doing some stuff right now. But we should say hello to him, shouldn't we? Gary Morris. Gary, Gary Morris Gary. Uh, and uh, his uh, partner, uh, uh, Chris Kyatt. These, folks, these guys have taken a small company. I joined them back in uh, 2007. I was one of the first brokers. And they now are the largest uh, brokerage firm in Canada. They're going to be doing $18 billion of business in Canada this coming year. Wow. Oh, wow. That's wow. That is wow. Let me ask you another personal question, Bill. Have you had breakfast yet? Because um, No. We, ha- we haven't either. It's, uh... No. <laughs> I, I missed my uh, my McDonald's and Tim Hortons this morning, so um, I'm just sit- sitting here with uh, normal, ha- what would I call it? Hotel coffee. Well, it could be a lot worse. I mean, some hotel coffee is pretty darn good, but we should tell our listeners that every Saturday morning, Bill shows up and he brings breakfast to everybody, so that's why we're missing him so much. Yeah, And we are. And we are. We're mm. missing you, Bill. So Bill Macklin, uh, who is the president of Dominion Macklin Mortgages, he's the resident mortgage expert on the show. He's up at Whistler. We'll be talking to Bill from time to time during the program this morning. So uh, you'll be up there. You've got the mortgage rate update coming up. What else is going on, Fern? Bill will also answer your mortgage question of the week. Now, later on in the show, Bill, what are we going to rant about today? Do I uh, we're gonna, well, we're going to talk a little bit about uh, what's going on up here in Whistler in terms of some house, house pricing and all that. We're also going to be talking again about the, the bureaucracy in our system and uh, how, it, how it affects all of us as taxpayers. So now, right if, I, if, if I want to buy a house in Whistler, does that mean I need to come and see you, my favorite mortgage broker, first? Probably, huh? Absolutely. There's, um, <laughs> we've af- actually, we've had this, uh, this seminar over this last four days. We realized that uh, we probably don't beat that drum hard enough. I got and you. We should uh, be beating that drum really hard in regards to see your mortgage provider first. Right on. Our radio real estate home handyman, Finn Jensen, is taking care of all things mechanical this weekend, so he will be back next Saturday. Mm-hmm. Monica. Hey, Monica. Yeah. Now, now, Bill, I was talking with Monica, and she loved how you says her name. So Monica Dinabriga? Close, yeah. So she's listening right now. She, say her uh, name again. Well, and, and, I, and I hope that she liked my comments about how <laughs> people, when they're, when they're calling her, they should actually have some kind of a plan of attack in terms of their... Their home cleaning. Might be a good idea, right? So she's on the show today, and she's got something special for us, Bill. What is she going to talk about? <laughs> she's going to tell us some favorite ways to get rid of the gummy residue. Oh, her household headache. Not gummy residue. <laughs> yeah, gummy residue. <laughs> oh, I, don't, I, I don't know what that looks like. Neither do I. But we're also going to be chatting with <laughs> Bob DeWitt. We all know Bob on the show. He's a great guy. He is the CEO of the Greater Vancouver Home Builders Association. This morning, Bob is, like Bill, he's on location at the Hard Rock Casino in Coquitlam for their annual fall renovation home renovation show and we'll also chat with ken shellcross uh he is the vice president of modern home tours we're going to talk about the third annual vancouver modern home tour and the first ever white rock modern home tour oh that that sounds like fun doesn't it Mm -hmm. bill's mortgage question of the week is coming up and if you have a question for bill leave it on our website radio real estate show.ca Radio Real Estate Show.ca. Bill will answer your question on next Saturday's show. And Andrea Jock of Keller Williams Elite Realty is joining us to look at the real estate market in the Tri Cities area. And Mark Perry, our Radio Real Estate Voice of the Valley, has more news about Platinum 2. And this morning, Mark isn't reporting from the Fraser Valley. He's not? 
What? Do you know where he is? I have no idea. Well, I guess we'll find out. That's Maybe he's in Whistler, too. Have you seen him? Have you seen him, Bill? No, I haven't. But you know what? Of the 600 people that were here, I barely saw any of them. We were so busy with all our uh, all our conventions. Does that mean that all the mortgage brokers up there from all across Canada cannot see straight? Is that what you're saying, Bill? <laughs> that could be also true first thing in the morning. Except for Bill Macklin, of course, yes. Our uh, our dear friend Eddie Matt, too, from the powerhouse agents at REMAX uh, West, uh, West Side Crest Realty is on the show this morning. And he's going to be giving us the heads up on the Vancouver, the greater Vancouver real estate market. And it's now 10.06, and you're listening to Radio Real Estate on Smooth and Easy CL. 6.50. You betcha. It is time now for the weekly mortgage rate update. Bill Macklin is on location. That uh, You know, you think he's out there having fun, just messing around. But no, he's hard at work. And what do you have for us this morning, Bill? Well, I have to tell you, the rates <coughs> the rates are, um, are are consistently good. We had um, we had uh, Sherry Cooper from the, the Dominion Center's um, economic report talking about how she doesn't think that we're going to see any drop further in the fixed rates. And so that if you're thinking that you're kind of sensitive to rate that you currently have, if it's variable, you may want to give your mortgage provider a call to discuss your options at this time. On the variable rates, the rates are still good. And you're, you're getting as low as 2 and sometimes 1.95 on your discounted variable rates. And there's a, there's a comment going around that the government of Canada may not drop the rate another quarter. I'm still thinking they will be, but I have no crystal ball. It's just a gut feeling. But I'm thinking that with what's going on in the States and the strong American economy, that we and they're going to be posting the rates up a little bit higher. We may have to do something. So, do you think it is time now to lock into something? If you if you have that that uh, nervousness about whether you're going to be able to make your payments in two or three years, now's the time to call your mortgage broker or your mortgage provider and just make sure that uh, you can actually make the payments you want to make over the next three to five years. So, if you're one of those people that has trouble sleeping at night, give your mortgage broker a call maybe after the show or first thing Monday, right, Billy? Now, in the next segment of the program, Bill will be back on the show to answer the mortgage question of the week. And later, we're going to chat about the annual home renovation show and the modern home tour, both taking place this weekend. And Monica Dinalbriga, the president of Mummy Maids, will join us to talk about her favorite ways to take care of, as Bill said, gummy residue. Oh, <laughs> You're listening to Vancouver's original on-air open house, the radio real estate show on Smooth and Easy CL650. Tom Lucas with my favorite service advisor in the entire world from North Vancouver, Nissan. Mike Farkas is on the line. Good to hear your voice again. We have a few days left of summer. Do you have something special for us? 10% off any maintenance service on any Nissan product and also a chance to win a $50 gift certificate or a uh, new car. There's three models that they're giving away uh, on, a, uh, on a draw and come down and fill it out. NorthVancouverNissan.com online. That's NorthVancouverNissan.com. Mike, have yourself a great day. You too. Hi, this is Fern Northcott from Remax Performance. Your real estate dreams begin with you. Real estate is the greatest investment you will ever make. Approach it as an adventure, financially and emotionally, without mistakes. I have a plan for making your real estate investments work for you. Call or text me, Fern Northcott at 604-790-9066, 604-790-9066, or visit fnorthcott.com. When you need it done, you need the Radio Real Estate Moving Team. What has four legs and can't walk? A table. When you need professional movers, Red Path Relocations is your one-stop shop. Across the city or around the world, your belongings are always safe with Red Path Relocations. And we sell packing materials, too. I'm Tim Redpath, and I'm proud to say that we're the newest member of Mayflower Van Lines Canada. Visit us at redpathrelocations.com or contact us at 604-945-9910. Red Path Relocations. Always ready, always reliable. And we always leave you with a smile. Hi, it's Lee from Diverse Electric. We offer a comprehensive and detailed free job estimate for all your residential and commercial service requirements. Outdoor living is here. Barbecues, get-togethers, company parties. Create that atmosphere with Diverse Electric Lighting. We service all of Metro Vancouver to Chilliwack. How well do you know the electricity in your house? If you have aluminum wiring, give us a call and we will make sure it's safe. 778-809-2532 or online at diverseelectricltd.ca. For more information, go to radiorealestateshow.ca and click on the link. 
Hi, it's Bill Macklem. In these busy and hectic times with family and business responsibilities, it is difficult to find the time to sit down with your mortgage broker and discuss all your mortgage options. I'm available to be with you at your place of work, your home, our office, or at a place convenient for you. Please give me a call at 604-684-HOME. That's 604-684-4663. CI650. We get better. All right, now we're going back up the mountain, up the big hill to Whistler. You there, Bill? I certainly am. Okay, have you changed out of the uh, nightgown into the sweater? Oh, I tell you, I need the sweater. It's a little chilly this morning. Well, not only that, because you can't answer the question. You can't take a request for a question without that sweater on, right? You should see this sweater. It is just gorgeous. Well, I had one like that back in 1967. had the stripes on it. I, I, it's a nice touch, Bill. So High Fern, school. Yeah, Fern yeah. has our question for you, Billy. Okay, right. Bill. Hi, Bill. This is for you. This Thank week's you. question comes from Parvinder Dillon of North Delta. Parvinder would like to know what steps she needs to take to make sure she qualifies for a mortgage. Thanks, Vern. That's a good question from Parvinder, I tell you. It's um, to ensure you qualify for a mortgage. You have to ensure you're dealing with a broker that uh, understands the difference between a pre-approval and a pre-qualification. There is a big difference. That broker will um, it's going to ask for a lot of documentation, which at times is going to seem a little invasive. I've had a couple of people, even some good friends, saying, like, do you really need this? Do they not trust me? With the new bank uh, compliance rules enforced by the government of Canada's governing body, so some of the lenders have actually lost their license or they've fired some of the underwriters if they don't adhere to these rules. So this is really important, and, and people don't realize how important this is. And it's not because the broker or the bank is asking for it. It's because of the fact that they have to comply with the rules. So you're going, to need, you're going to need some stuff, and it's not going to be easy. You're going to need a current pay stub. You're going to need three months of bank savings showing pay deposits. If you're employed by a company who does not uh, have, like, Ceridian or one of those uh, national uh, payroll companies because they want to make sure that this is handwritten on a pay stub, you need to have proof that it comes in there. You need your notices of assessment from Revenue Canada. So people say, well, why do I need this stuff? Well, the current pay stub shows that you're currently being employed. Your notice of assessments from Rev Canada show that you worked last year and you actually don't owe any taxes to the government of Canada. You need some T1 generals if you're self-employed or you get some retirement income. They want to see where that comes from. And they need all the pages. So those 15 or 20 or 25 pages, they need them all. If you're self-employed, they're going to need your T4s. Or if you're commission income, you're going to need your T4s or T4As if you're retired. Um, if you are employed, they're going to need an employment letter, but not today. They need your employment within 30 days of taking possession because it has to be current. They will also make a phone check to your employer. They will look at your down payment verification. We have to have a 90-day history. It's either in savings or RSPs. If it's a gift, that's even more detailed. You have to have a gift letter from the gifter, and it can only be a related family member. You have to have a bank statement showing that the money that you have on account before the gift. Then when you get the bank statement after the gift, and you have to show a copy of the check that the parents gave to show that you actually got the money from the parents. So it's it's very detailed. But if you supply all our documentation, you can be almost guaranteed that you qualify for the mortgage amount that your mortgage provider will get a commitment for. For expert mortgage information online, visit billymac.com. That's Billy with an I, not a Y, M-A-C dot com or call Bill at 604-684-684. Four six six three. That's six zero four six eight four. Home. Thank you, Fern. Thank you, Bill. Bill's mortgage question of the week is brought to you by InstaFund, the number one source for private mortgage funds in Metro Vancouver. Online, you'll find them at InstaFund.com. That's InstaFund.com. In the Tri Cities, call Angela Jock at six zero four seven eight three three one two four or visit Pinnacle Group dash R dash E dash m dot com pinnacle group rem dot com and right now on the line we have all the way from the tri-cities are you ready here's andrea jock andrea good morning good morning tom hi everyone how are you fantastic last week we were looking to talk to you but of course you were too busy doing one of those big real estate deals it looks pretty good huh yeah it's really exciting i'll have some more details to fill you in shortly all right we're going to keep our fingers crossed i know the real estate market is really heating up out there in the tri-cities i guess it's just as hot right yeah it sure is it's been a busy start to September now that everyone is back from holidays and focused on finding their new home before Christmas. 
Today I'm featuring a spectacular waterfront opportunity in Belcara. This beautiful 3,800 square foot West Coast contemporary home is situated on a 20,000 square foot lot on one of the premier streets in Belcara. The settler's home is currently under renovation and will be finished to the highest standard. And it offers its very own private dock. Visit PinnacleGroupMarketing.com for more information. Tomorrow at 8 a.m., join the 35th Terry Fox Hometown Run, starting at the High Creek Recreation Center in Port Coquitlam. This is Andrea Jock for Radio Real Estate. Thank you, Andrea. In the Tri-Cities, you can call Andrea Jock for more information, 604-783-3124. That's 604-783-3124. Or go online to PinnacleGroupREM.com. That's PinnacleGroupREM.com. Coming up in the show, we'll be hearing from Monica Dinalbrigo, the president of Mommy Maids. This is for Northcott of the REMAX Performance with mortgage expert Bill Macklem, president of Dominion Macklem Mortgage, producer Dwayne Bishop and Tom Lucas, you're listening to Radio Real Estate, Vancouver's original on-air open house on smooth and easy CL650. I'm Adam Corbin, president of InstaFund. Our family has been in the mortgage business for four generations, and InstaFund offers some of the lowest second mortgage rates in BC. Do you have a high interest second mortgage on your property? It's time to ask your mortgage broker to help you reduce your monthly payments and increase your cash flow. Ask your mortgage broker if InstaFund is the answer to your mortgage needs. Or call me, Adam Corbett, at 604-687-2020. Visit our website at instafund.com. Hi, this is Stuart Goodman, the General Sales Manager at North Vancouver Nissan, part of the Delari Automotive Group. Come and visit us in the North Shore Auto Mall and see the all-new 2016 Nissan Maxima and new Murano. Visit North Vancouver Nissan, home of the new purchase experience, in the North Shore Auto Mall or online at northvancouvernissan.ca. That's in the North Shore Auto Mall or online at northvancouvernissan.ca. Hi, this is Fern Northcott of REMAX Performance. Your real estate dreams begin with you. You deserve the facts of a professional home evaluation based on the statistics of the MLS. To find out what your house is really worth, call or text me. Fern Northcott, 604-790-9066, 604-790-9066, or visit fnorthcott.com. When you need it done, you need the Radio Real Estate Moving Team. Hi, Ryan from Diverse Electric, offering top quality work at competitive rates. Together, we at Diverse Electric have 15 years of business and project management experience. Call us at 778-809-2532 or through our website at diverseelectricltd.ca. When you're looking for an electrical contractor who can handle any size residential or commercial project, call Diverse Electric 778-809-2532 or through our website at diverseelectricltd.ca. How much does a polar bear weigh? Enough to break the ice. Actually, the average polar bear weighs 1,100 pounds. Here at Redpath Relocations, we're that good. With more than 30 years experience estimating, we can ensure everything is accurately accounted for and you have the best price with no hidden costs. Check us out at redpathrelocations.com or give us a call at 604-945-9910. Redpath Relocations. Always ready, always reliable. For more information, go to radiorealestateshow.ca and click on the link. Hi, this is Bill Macklem of Dominion Macklem Mortgages. Over the past 25 years, I have found most home purchasers do not use a mortgage broker. We are a no-charge professional who have assisted over 5,000 home buyers finance their home. The exciting part is these same home buyers come back to us for refinancing, buying their next property, or lowering their current payments. Call us at 604-684-HOME. That's 604-684-4663 for more information. Vancouver weather. Well, it's the last weekend of summer. <clears throat> oh, geez. Yeah, I know. Now that's why it's cloudy and why it's raining outside. It's going to rain today. It's going to rain tomorrow. And it's going to rain right now until spring. So let's just get a <laughs> raincoat and carry on. Right now, get the, the umbrella. <laughs> I think so. It's 14 degrees right now in the wet radio real estate show. CI 650. Bedroom, bathroom, living room, dining room. Yeah, 
bedroom, bathroom, dining room, living room, kitchen, any house, any house, any room in the house, we can fix it up and make it look good, right? Now, sure Fern, can. you know from doing real estate that there are a lot of people that have got into a starter home, and because of the prices these days, they're staying in that starter home for a lot longer. Yes, they are. Yeah, yeah so they what, are. what they should do maybe is fix it up a little bit if you're going to be there for a while. Um, yes, and if they're going to be doing that, concentrate on the kitchens and the bathrooms because that's always what sells the house, no matter how old <laughs> it is. Absolutely. And we're going down now to uh, Coquitlam. We're going out to a, a place we've all been for different reasons, uh, but this guy is there for a very special reason. It's the Fall Renovation Show brought to you by the Greater Vancouver Home Builders Association. We have the CEO on the line this morning. We're going right to the top. Mr. DeWitt, Bob, good morning. How are you? Good, Tom. How about yourself? I'm, well, I've been up early because I knew you were going to be down there early this morning. Awesome. Well, this weather is perfect, isn't it? It's what? perfect for home runners. <laughs> <laughs> Don't go there, Bob. <laughs> so, Bob, I'm glad you brought that up. Now, if I was to come down today uh, in my car, do I have very far to go from the parking lot to get inside? No, actually, uh, it's free parking, and it took me, I'm parked about two, uh, less than a minute walk from the front door, so you can just rush from your car to the to the uh, to the facility, and we've got a great day's plan. We've got seminars, we've got one-on-one consultations, we've got over two dozen renovator contractors here. It's uh, so far just opened the doors, and people have just started coming in. It's a great day so far. That's great. I should ask you how much it costs to get in. It's free to get oh, in, geez, and we have free. prizes uh, on the floor, so there's uh, you can come away with a few free freebies if you want. Are you kidding us? It's free to get in. You've got free seminars. We have pros we can talk to. Yeah, well, I think what what sets this show apart from your regular home shows is that it's really a, it's a boutique show where you can meet with the contractors and the designers one on one. We have, and if you're not comfortable with that, we've also got seminars that will teach you all the things you need to know about uh, home renovation. So everything from uh, how to finance it, uh, particular topics like kitchen space and design uh, that was mentioned earlier. Uh, working with small spaces, a lot of people have smaller places that they're that they're renovating, and we've got some novel ideas about how to deal with that, and the experts who do, who do that. Bathroom trends and features, and then of course, one of my favorites, uh, legal nuts and bolts. So, so how when you do do a renovation, how you uh, do it properly legally, and then also we've got uh, some veterans who talk about how to work with a professional renovator. So we've got the full spectrum uh, covered here, and it's uh, open to the public from 10 to 4 today here at the Hard Rock Casino in Coquitlam. Boy, that sounds pretty awesome. One-stop shopping. One-stop shopping, that's right. It's all there. So if I have any questions or thought, I can go maybe see the guy that does the roof or whatever, or the guy that paints the the bathroom walls and have a chat, right? Exactly. So, I mean, unlike a, a, you know a larger home show where you've got squeegees and gadgets and things of that nature, all you have here are designers. And um, and renovators and 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 suppliers of, of materials, so all the things that you need for a renovation. Now, I mean, Bob, one, one of the sorry, uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Go ahead, sorry. I was going to say, for example, we've got a guy named Jamie Banfield, who's uh, sort of the uh, the Connor McDavid of kitchen space and design. He's sort of a young phenom, and he's doing a, a seminar at uh, 12:30. Uh, so you can come and see a fellow like that and also talk to him afterwards one-on-one to get some tips on your own uh, renovation. A lot of people, uh, you know, renovations are a big, can be a big investment, so people take time to, to make their decisions. So this is a good way to get the information first, meet a few people and build some relationships that you can then eventually, uh, you know, work with some of the people that you meet here today. Well, Bob, just a second ago, I said uh, people getting into the home renovation industry, and I said guys. There, it seems to me that there'd be more and more women getting involved in the industry as well, right? Absolutely. So especially on the design side. So, I mean, a mm-hmm. lot of our designers are, are women, and, and we've got a female renovators. It's, it's, uh, I mean, it takes a, an aesthetic eye to, make, to do a, an effective renovation, and, and uh, that is not uh, – that is both men and women. So it's um, come, I think you, anybody can come down here today and feel comfortable to find someone to talk to. I'm kind of hoping, Bob, that you'll get me the name and number of one of those female designers because last time I did some designing in the house, a Bill Macklin drew me a couple of plans, and not good. <laughs> <laughs> Stick to mortgages, well, Bill. <laughs> we're here to help. So, I mean, uh, Tom, come on down uh, after, your, after your show, and we'll be, we'll be here. And uh, you can get some free advice, and, uh, you know, uh, you don't have to take Bill's advice, and uh, you'll probably be better off. <laughs> free is good, Bob. Listen, if somebody's listening to us today and they want to come down and, and uh, say hello to you and, and say hello to some of the other people working down there, where do we find you? How do we get there? Okay, this the show is from 10 to 4. We're at the Hard Rock Casino in Coquitlam, which is at 2080 United Boulevard. It's, uh, it's easy to find, free parking. 
and uh, I'll be around the floor and so will my staff and of course all the designers and renovators will be here so we expect a good turnout so come on out as soon as you can and especially uh, grab one of these seminars because as I said they're free and it's a great way to grab some hard to get information. Absolutely. In Absolutely. Well, you enjoy your day. I know you're going to be a busy boy down there. I got to stop by your office. Make sure you have the coffee on and the frozen cookies, okay? Awesome. Thanks, Tom. <laughs> have a great day. Thanks, Bob. That's Bob the Thanks, Bob. He is the CEO of the Greater Vancouver Home Builders Association and he's on location all day at the Fall Reno Show, which is happening at the Hard Rock and Casino. It's Radio Real Estate 25 minutes after 10 o'clock, 10:25 on the other line all the way from New York City from the Big Apple. I've got uh, Ken Shellcross. Ken, good morning. Hi, good morning. How are you, buddy? I'm doing very well, thank you. How are you guys? I'm wonderful. It's raining up here. Is it raining in New York City? It is. It mm. is not. It is not. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> we'll send you some. Mild and somewhat nice. I hate to tell you that. <laughs> well, Ken is the uh, vice president of Modern Home Tours. We've got something pretty spectacular going on in the lower mainland uh, this weekend. Today, you've got the third annual Vancouver and then the first ever White Rock uh, Parade. So let's talk a little bit about those. Tell us a bit about the Vancouver one, first of all. Sure. Uh, this is our third Modern Home Tour in Vancouver, our third year in a row. Uh, the homes are actually located uh, throughout the um, uh, you know Vancouver proper, but then there's also a couple up in North Vancouver on the North Shore as well. It's a nice spread out diversity of a lot of really wonderful designs, all from local architects. So now after we go on, and this is a self-guided tour, correct? Right. Okay. The tour is completely self-guided. You set your own pace. There are seven different homes to visit, and you choose your route. You can choose how long you want to spend at each one. You can choose where to eat along the way. Uh, the tour runs from 11 o'clock, so it's going to start in just about 30 minutes, and it's going to go until 5 o'clock tonight. You have six hours to basically get around and see every home that you can. Now, Ken, I've been on one of these uh, tours, and they're just fantastic, a great way to learn things. And sometimes the owner of the house is around, not all the time, but sometimes the owner is there, and they're very nice people, and they're willing to talk to you and tell you what they've had done and the headaches they went through and the, the joys and gratification they got out of the deal. Yeah, that's actually something that we really, really encourage. Um, we... When we ask people to participate, we want full participation. We want the architects and the builders to be there, but we also want the homeowners to be there because aside from hearing about how the design process came to life and the collaboration between builder and architect, there's also that really special relationship between homeowner and architect. And um, I've, you know, I have seen it where these friendships and bonds that are formed really almost last a lifetime because... We have somebody design your house, and every day you wake up and you look at their design. Uh, so when the homeowners are there to sort of add that little extra descriptive element to talk about the home, not only like, oh, how it came together, but I love this space because every day I do this here, or whatever the case may be. It really, I mean, we want everybody to be able to not only show off their design, but homeowners show off your house. Ken, what made you pick the area of White Rock this time to be on the tour? Um, actually, uh, somebody came to us. Um, KBC, the Clewer uh, Brothers Construction down there, asked us about participating in Vancouver, and we looked at the map and said, that's just too far. We want, um, <laughs> you know, all the, uh, all the homes kind of have to be from end to end, have to really be no longer than an hour in distance. If you figure it would take you an hour and then you stop along the way to mm -hmm. get from home to home. So White Rock was just out of it. And um, uh, Shauna, who uh, called us and said, you know, I, I think I might be able to help you out. So we enlisted her as the curator, and I give full credit to her for bringing all the homes in White Rock on board. She um, led us to people and told everybody about us and, the, and the how, you know, we've been doing this in Vancouver for a couple of years at that point, and, um, and she really, you know, kind of really helped us bring it together. All the Lower Mainland has some fantastic houses, but White Rock is really dead up to the nine, so you've made a good choice going to White Rock this year. Absolutely. Yeah, I... Um, you know, unfortunately, uh, being stuck here in New York City, uh, when when pulling this together, kind of had to rely on photos. And let me tell you, I was very jealous. <laughs> uh, those homes in White Rock are just, and, and not to, you know, downplay any of the other homes in any of the other area, but they are just really amazing, gorgeous, really, really nice homes. Let me, uh, let me, all of let, them. I mean, if you just look at the street views of some of these neighborhoods, they're really amazing. Let me do something to make you feel at home. Are you ready, Ken? Sure. WABC 77 New York. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> okay, I'll keep practicing. So it's uh, 1029 up here in the coast. There. Now, what time does somebody want to think, this is a pretty nifty thing Ken's talking about. How do I get involved? What time does it start? How do I get tickets? Where do I go? What do I do? Uh, well, for... 
tickets for tomorrow. Tomorrow is the White Rock Tour. It's right. the same times, just different set of homes. You can still buy tickets for those online if you go to modernhometours.com. One of our upcoming events is the uh, White Rock Home Tour, and you can still uh, buy tickets for tomorrow. If you want to run out the door and head and go see the homes in Vancouver today, um, go to modernhometours.com. Find the uh, Vancouver event page. It's listed under upcoming events. On that page is a map of all the homes. Pick one of those homes as your starting point. Go to the home. It's $45 on the day of. That will get you a wristband that will get you into every home. They will give you a map with the addresses, and from there you can take it on yourself. Um, you can also uh, you know, bookmark the map from the computer when you're on our event site. That sounds good. So the website, once again, is... Uh, ModernHomeTours.com. Just straight and forward. ModernHomeTours.com. Get your tickets. It's the, uh, wow, the Modern Homes Tour in Vancouver and then also in White Rock tomorrow. So we've been yep. talking. Yeah, Ken, uh, we got to get you to come up here. You, uh, you can practice saying CL 650, and I'll practice tomorrow saying WABC 77 New York. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hey, thanks for doing this with us. Uh, keep the umbrella handy because I'm going to send you some rain, Ken. Yeah, thank you. Uh, <laughs> thanks for having me on, and and I wish I could send the sunshine your way. Well, we'll work thank on you, that. Thank you, Ken. We'll talk again real soon, Ken. Thanks so much. Thank you so much. Thank <laughs> Enjoy you. your weekend. That's Ken Shellcross. He is the vice president of Modern Home Tours. They have a big, spectacular tour going on in Vancouver. Yeah, that's today and tomorrow in White Rock. So take it in if you can. It's the Radio Real Estate Show. Fern, what's happening in the next segment of the program? Oh, in the next segment of our program, Tom, our real, of our really Radio Real Estate Show, Voice of the Valley will be bringing us up to date on Platinum 2 in Chilliwack and the cleanup woman, Monica Dunaubriga. See, it's I not hope, easy, is it? I know. No, I hope no. I did that okay for you, She's Monica. She's going to have to change her name. I'm there sorry. There you go. <laughs> we'll just go by first names, okay? Uh, from Mommy Maids, we'll be here to share one of her favorite ways to deal with gummy residue. Gummy residue? Oh, forget You ever had gummy residue? No. I, I've had it many times. <laughs> I thought you had to take a pill for it, but apparently there's a better way to get rid of it, so we'll find out in just a minute. It's Tom Lucas. Good morning. Our co-host is Fern Northcott of Remax Performance Realty. Bill Macklem, the president of Dominion Macklem Mortgages, is on location in Whistler today. And our producer, Dwayne Bishop, is here. And you are listening to Radio Real Estate on Smooth and Easy, Sea Isle 650. Hi, this is Monica from Mummy Maids. We're here to help you with all your cleaning needs, including move-in, move-outs, packing and unpacking, organizing, laundry and windows, walls, basic cleaning and custom cleaning. We do it all. You deserve a break and Mummy Maids can help. Let us clean your castle with no hassle. Call 604-533-4959. That's 604-533-4959. Or visit us at mummymaids.com. Tom Lucas with my favorite service advisor in the entire world from North Vancouver, Nissan. Mike Farkas is on the line. Good to hear your voice again. We have a few days left of summer. Do you have something special for us? 10% off any maintenance service on any Nissan product and also a chance to win a $50 gift certificate or a uh, new car. There's three models that they're giving away uh, on, a, uh, on a draw and come down and fill it out. NorthVancouverNissan.com online. That's NorthVancouverNissan.com. Mike, have yourself a great day. You too. When you need it done, you need the Radio Real Estate Moving Team. What has four legs and can't walk? A table. When you need professional movers, Red Path Relocations is your one-stop shop. Across the city or around the world, your belongings are always safe with Red Path Relocations. And we sell packing materials, too. I'm Tim Redpath, and I'm proud to say that we're the newest member of Mayflower Van Lines Canada. Visit us at redpathrelocations.com or contact us at 604-945-9910. Red Path Relocations, always ready, always reliable, and we always leave you with a smile. Hi, it's Lee from Diverse Electric. We offer a comprehensive and detailed free job estimate for all your residential and commercial service requirements. Outdoor living is here. Barbecues, get-togethers, company parties. Create that atmosphere with Diverse Electric Lighting. We service all of Metro Vancouver to Chilliwack. How well do you know the electricity in your house? If you have aluminum wiring, give us a call and we will make sure it's safe. 778-809-2532 or online at diverseelectricltd.ca. For more information, go to radiorealestateshow.ca and click on the link. When you have a challenging mortgage situation, where do you turn? 
private mortgage lenders have picked up where the banks have left many borrowers scrambling. I'm Adam Corbin, president of InstaFund. Borrow from InstaFund for any reason. Purchase more property, build a development, buy out your landlord, or pay other debts. And let's not forget taxes. We can help pay those too. Ask your mortgage broker to call InstaFund for a quote or call me, Adam Corbin, at 604-687-2020. Visit our website at instafund.com. Hi, this is Bill Macklem of Dominion Macklem Mortgages. As a successful broker owner, I have developed a team of mortgage professionals that support me and my clients. If you're confused with all the mortgage chatter of do's and don'ts, my mortgage team is ready to answer your questions to determine the best mortgage for you. Call 604-684-HOME. That's 604-684-4663 for more information. CIL 650. The cleanup woman, she's tough. A cleanup woman gets up in the morning. She goes, ha, dirt, ha, get out of my way. I'm going to fix you, ha. It's time now for the cleanup woman. She is the president of Mommy Maids. Monica is on the line. Monica, ha, good morning. Good morning, Tom. Eucalyptus oil removes gummy residue left on shop stickers. Spread it on and just let it sit, and then it will come right off. Buffing a marble tabletop with car polish leaves a thin, invisible flame that helps reduce the risk of stains. To remove furniture oil indentations from pure wool carpet, Place a tea towel over the area, then press with a warm iron. The heat will lift the fibers, but do not attempt this on synthetic or wool synthetic mixed carpets. Light a match and let it burn a few seconds to remove toilet smells. It cleans the air. To stop bathroom mirrors from steaming up, regularly rub a dry bar of soap over the surface and rub it in with a clean cloth. Stop clothes with thin straps from falling off the hangers by sticking small felt furniture pads onto the hanger just beyond where the straps sit. They'll stay on the hanger. This is Monica Dinabriga for Radio Real Estate. Let Mommy Maids clean your castle with no hassle. Call Monica at 533-4953. That's 604-533-4959. Or visit mommymaids.com. That's mommymaids.com. For more information, absolutely. Thank you, Fern. It's the Radio Real Estate Show. It's... 1037. It's raining in town today. Fern brought this huge Remax umbrella in. Thank you for that. You're welcome. And now I wonder why everybody's left town. Let me see. Bill Macklin's in Whistler. We just spoke with Ken Shellcross. He's in New York City. Mm-hmm. And usually we talk to Mark Perry, who is the voice of the Valley, who's usually out in Chilliwack. But alas and alack, you're not in Chilliwack this morning, are you, Mark? No, Tom. Good morning, uh, Tom. Good morning, Bill. Good morning, Fern. Yeah. Good morning. I'm actually at- I'm actually at the Palm Springs Airport, heading back to uh, BC. <laughs> the Palm Springs Airport. So, how was your visit down in Palm Springs? It was beautiful. It's very sunny down here. It's everything that we retirees want to want to have. It's uh, it's a great place to be, and uh, there's lots of exciting stuff to do down here too. So, all right. Well, let's suppose that Fern and I live in Vancouver, which we almost do, and and we're thinking about you know, hey, we'd like to move down there to Palm Springs. Can we afford it? What's the what's the price of housing like down there? Yeah, you know, Palm Springs is bustling away. They've got uh, four hotels, big hotels that they're building down in the city here. Um, the real estate uh, you can buy from a mobile a modular home from about fifty to sixty grand, and it goes really to the sky's the limit. Um, and you know, I mean, I noticed one thing that there's quite a few golf courses here that sort of were maybe subpar that are <laughs> closing down, and they're actually doing adult lifestyle communities with assisted living, you know, in, in place of the golf courses and stuff. And, of course, they've got these great phenomenal golf courses that make lots of money, but the little ones are having a tougher time with the competition. Did you ever get the idea, Mark, maybe you should go down to Palm Springs again, buy yourself a golf course, and uh, do another Inglewood down there? <laughs> I was kind of thinking it myself. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what they say? They say great minds think alike. Idiots seldom differ. <laughs> So you're, I know I I like to tease you a lot, Mark. I know but we say you've been down there just goofing off, but I know you've been down there working and you're heading home right now. Now, if somebody is, is thinking about, well, we can't make it down to Palm Springs, but we can make it out to Chilliwack this weekend, and uh, we should go by and have a look at Inglewood Courtyard because they're always talking about Inglewood Court on the radio. And tell us why we should go out there. Number one, it's a it's an adult community, so there's no little rugrats around, right? That's right. You know, <laughs> our people are looking for a gated community. They've, uh, they're tired of the, the, the trikes and the trampolines and their and next, next-door neighbors. They love kids, but they want them to come visit, not to be their next-door neighbors. And that's what the beauty of uh, Inglewood Courtyard is. Uh, location, walk to shopping, and uh, your neighbors are your peers that you probably went to work, uh, work with or you might have gone to school with. 
You know, I like what you say is true because you can invite the grandchildren over and uh, they're such little darlings and then get them wired up on sugar and then just send them home. And then just send them home, Tom. And, and then just close the doors and, and you and, and mom can have a happy life at Inglewood Courtyard, right? <laughs> that works. Yeah, you know what? Exactly. It's just a, It really is a, a great retirement community and, uh, you know, we've been so successful and we're Tillabuck's number one development. And, uh, you know, our platinum too that we've just announced We've already got four sold now, and, uh, you know, that's that's exciting stuff. A little larger suites. We've got the suites from uh, 1,200 square feet through 1,700 square feet. So uh, it's what our people are looking for. They don't want to down, they're downsizing, but they don't want to downsize to an 800 square foot. They want to they still want some space. You know, if Platinum 2 is anything, I mean, anything at all, like your original uh, 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 project, boy, oh, boy, I'm telling you, people are set for some nice living out there. Yeah, yeah, they're really yeah. well. You know, it's a great retirement community. And I invite all our listeners to come on out and uh, come and see us this weekend. We've got lots of stuff going out here in the Valley. Um, you know, I'm coming back for uh, Sunday is the Terry Fox run in Abbotsford and Chilliwack. Mm-hmm. So it uh, should be exciting to see everyone. Please drop by. We've got the coffee on. So you're flying home. You're not walking, right? Because you'll be pretty tired when you get here. Uh, you know, I'm going to be uh, well rested because <laughs> I'm leaving in about uh, half an hour to uh, back to to Bellingham, and it's about a half an hour from Bellingham to uh, uh, to Chilliwack, so it's nice and easy commute. And boy, I tell you, these uh, the fares are cheap to get down here. I see cheap flight, huh? <laughs> well done, Mark. <laughs> Way to go. Hey, Mark, listen, before you go, somebody's listening to the show today. They say, hey, this Mark sounds like a nice guy. I live in Vancouver. I want to get out to Chilliwack. I get on Highway 1, then what do I do? So you get on the Highway 1, you come eastbound, and you take the number 3 road exit. And that's the number 3 road in the Fraser Valley, not in Richmond. You take that exit, and you'll see the uh, our banner sign that's on the side of a big golf semi-truck. And follow the sign, and follow all our signs to uh, Keith Wilson Road. And when you come up Keith Wilson Road, we're right at the very end. And Inglewood Courtyard is uh, the adult lifestyle at the very end of the road. I think your plane is boarding. It's getting ready to taxi down the runway, so you better get on it. But we're going to chat next week. How's that? Thanks, folks. Wonderful to talk to you. This is Mark Perry, the voice of the Valley on the Radio Real Estate Show. You have a great flight home. We'll talk to you next week, Mark. Thanks, buddy. Thank you, Mark. Call Mark at Platinum 2 Inglewood Courtyard in Chilliwack. The toll-free number is 778-240-8513. That's 778-240-8513. Or go to inglewoodcourtyard.ca for more information. In the next segment of the program, Bill Macklin will be back online with us. And Bill's going to be talking a little bit about Whistler and... God knows what else Bill's going to talk about. It's a radio real estate show, and uh, Greater Vancouver real estate is quite interesting. Everybody likes to talk about that, and we will do so with Andy Matu of the Powerhouse Agents at Remax Crest Realty Westside. This is for Northcott of Remax Performance Realty with Bill Macklin, president of Dominion Macklin Mortgages, producer Dwayne Bishop, and Tom Lucas. You're listening to Vancouver's original open air radio real estate show on Smooth and Easy CL 650. I'm Adam Corbin, president of Instafund, one of BC's most established private mortgage lenders. Many people these days can't rely on the banks for a mortgage. Whether you're self-employed, have credit challenges, or are new to home ownership, sometimes it seems impossible to get the banks to understand you. Instafund can help. Call me directly at 604-687-2020 or ask your mortgage broker if Instafund is the answer to your mortgage needs. Visit our website at instafund.com. Your life's too busy to be doing the things that you don't want to do. Hi, it's Monica at Mommy Maids. We'll free up your time by taking care of all your cleaning needs. We have weekly, bi-weekly, monthly, or one-time special occasion plans available, including move-in and move-outs. Commercial and residential cleaning performed by bonded, insured, WCB-covered, uniform cleaning experts. You deserve a break, and Mommy Maids can help. Let us clean your castle with no hassle. Call 604-533-4959 or visit mummymaids.com. Hi, this is for Northcott of Remax Performance. Your real estate dreams begin with you. Baby boomers move for various reasons. Perhaps your home is just too big or you want to buy that toy you always wanted. Together, we will make that happen. Call or text me for Northcott, 604-790-9066, 604-790-9066 or visit fnorthcott.com. Hi, this is Bill Macklin from Dominion Macklin Mortgages. Most people need advice on mortgage financing. We provide personal financial advice with no vested interest and at no cost. We're compensated by the lenders. We'll review your current financial situation to determine if you are ready to purchase. If not, we'll help develop a plan to put home ownership in your future. 
For more information, call 604-684-4663. That's 604-684-HOME. Vancouver Weather. Clouds and rain this morning, tapering off to showers and clouds this afternoon. What's the difference? Uh, today's <laughs> high about 17 degrees, cloudy and windy overnight, lows down to 16. Periods of rain tomorrow and wet again on Monday. And right now, it's 14 degrees on the Radio Real Estate Show. CI 650. Bring it on home. Bring it on home to me. There's the late, great Sam Cook. You're listening to Radio Real Estate. Tom Lucas along with Fern Northcott. It's uh, 1045, 50 minutes now before 11 o'clock. And it's time to look at Lower Mainland Real Estate. And uh, we're going to chat with Andy Matu with the Powerhouse Agents at REMAX Crest Realty West Side. He's on the phone line right now. Andrew, good morning, sir. Good morning, Tom. How are you doing today? I'm good. Guess what? It's the last official weekend of summer. Right. Oh, really? I thought yeah. summer was already over with this weather. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> October and November can be nice around here. Now, brings me to this. You have some clients in Ontario that are moving out to British Columbia because they love our weather, they love the sunshine, and they love the housing market. So they're moving to where? Lumbee? Yeah, they're Lumbee, B.C., up north. they got family in Kelowna. Met them up there. They bought a nice little house. It's a great area. And we know down here in the Lower Mainland it's a great area, too, especially for home buyers, because if you're thinking of selling right now, you can get more than you anticipated for your home. Yes, you can. And a lot of people don't know that still, right? Um, they think they want to sell it on their own. You should get a professional to appraise it and, you know, get the most value out of it. We <laughs> call them FISBOs for sale by owner. They like to do it all on their own. And I think a lot of people that listen to the show don't really realize what a real estate agent can do for them. Experts in this industry, you can get more money. They think saving 10 grand, but you could be losing 30. Yeah, it makes a lot of sense. So if you're thinking about making that move now, if you want to maybe get out of your house and get somebody in there and get a new place before Christmas, call our friends over at the Powerhouse team. Andy and Don are going to take good care of you. I understand that you have a hot listing. In fact, it's so hot, we've never heard it before. It hasn't even hit the market yet. It's going to be investor or builder's uh, alert here on this one. It's right in North Surrey. It's a 65 by 117 lot. You could build a nice little house on that one. Prices to be determined. So if you're interested, give us a call and we'll take you through it. I guess you're going to take a week off and Don will be here next week, right? That's true. Hopefully. <laughs> He's still on holidays, actually, so you might have to call me back. <laughs> well, I, I listen, I like talking. I'm talking to both of you. Anyway, Andy, <laughs> you have a great week, my friend. You too. Take care. This is Andy Matthew for Radio Real Estate. Put your powerhouse agents to work for you. Call Don or Andy at 604-307-3000. That's 604 604- 307 3000 or visit powerhouseagents.ca powerhouseagents.ca Yeah, there's Donna Summer and she works hard for the money. She works so hard hard for the money but not like bill macklin he's the hardest working mortgage guy in the industry he's you'd think he'd be relaxing today but no he's up at whistler he's at a big seminar and a conference up there with mortgage brokers from all across the nation eh bill that's right yeah that's right are you teaching them anything today say that again are you teaching them anything today uh no i'm not no today uh, this is my radio real estate show today oh i see so, so, so this is what i'm i'm focused on today completely <laughs> and talking to a number of our realtors out here. I've got a couple of buddies here, Frank Wright, Michael D'Artois, and John McGregor, who have been uh, doing business with me over the last uh, 20 years. Wow. So looking at some of the properties they have up here, just kind of get a feel for it. Well, Bill, and, you, Bill you, and you've, been, you, going to. you've been doing this mortgage thing now for quite some time. I mean, you're in the studio with us, and you talk about being in Winnipeg and moving out here in the 1800s and starting up your... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. Your mortgage industry, but you've been doing this for a long time, helping people out. Yes, I have. It's been it's been a real thrill. I've been really fortunate. I've been surrounded by uh, really fantastic staff, and uh, we are, have clients that are just unbelievable. They're, you know, they become more like family than become clients. All right. Now, if we have some new people listening to the show today, and they're thinking, you know what, this uh, this Macklem guy sounds like a nice guy, and I I want to talk to Fern after the show and maybe buy a little house, but I need some money, so they should come and get in touch with you. So, how, how do they get in touch with the bill if they've never talked to you before? The easiest way is just give me a call at six zero four six eight four four six six three. Okay. That's six zero four six eight four home. 
All right, so that's simple enough. If, you, uh, if you're if you new in the area, you live in South Syria, it doesn't matter where you live, Bill will come to your house. Give him a call, 604-684-HOME. Now, Bill, we don't like to tie up too much. We want to let you go. We want to take the reins off, and the airwaves are all yours. What's on your mind? And I'm afraid to ask Bill. Go right ahead. Well, we could talk a little bit about real estate, but, you know, you know me. I like to talk about something that is close to my heart, and that would be transportation, highways, roadways, and so I'm on my way to Whistler, and I haven't been to Whistler since uh, before the Olympics, which would be 2010. Mm-hmm. And I've been hearing about how they're building the road, and they're spending all this money in the road, and they're moving all the rock and blasting down the mountains, and they're hauling all that stuff all over the place to, to build these roads. So I leave Horseshoe Bay, and I come into what I would call a chicane. What's a chicane? Well, a, a chicane Glad is an artificial asked. feature, it's creating extra turns in a road used in motor racing, and also on residential streets to slow traffic down. And I'm thinking, <laughs> we have a billion-dollar jewel in the mountains called Whistler. And we have some trail that puts people's lives at risk, even on sunny, dry days, let alone rainy or snowy, inclement weather. And for people who don't come here a lot, we may have some tourists that want to visit Whistler. And so they put these shallow S-shaped turns in the road, slows your rate down. No wonder people get killed. And I don't understand why they would do that. This is a responsibility of the government to provide the best possible solutions to traffic movement. If you look at all the places in the world, Switzerland, Italy, Virginia, New Zealand, Poland, Norway, Australia, China, Oregon, Washington, they all build tunnels. Oh, why would we do a tunnel? Well, it's fairly straight. It's fairly straight and fairly safe. Uh, it's away from snow. It's away from rain. Uh, you have two lanes going in each direction, and they're they're sort of separated by that that brick wall, so to speak. So they're all going in the same direction. They're rainproof. I mean, why wouldn't you do that? And the road would be straighter and safer for people to drive on. They do it in the rest of the world. Why would we blast down mountains and haul rock? I mean, like that's going back to the 1700s when I traveled from Winnipeg to here by by my ox cart. So, <laughs> does not make sense to me. I just don't believe it. And you're putting people's lives at risk. I mean, I don't know who designs these highways. I mean, what, you know, they design as if it, it was your neighbor that's lived there for the last 50 years, and so they know all the turns that were safe, right? No, we're dealing with new people who don't know the area. Give them a chance to get to where they're going safely and make it a good experience. But we're not making it a good experience. Now, you said on the road to Worcester what they should do is maybe build some more tunnels, but we have a tunnel over here by the radio station, the... The Massey Tunnel, remember that one? I do. Yeah, but now they're going to build a bridge because they want those bigger ships to come in here. That's the real reason, right? That's the real reason. But, you know, Thank if they you. had done what they were supposed to do back in the 50s, they would have had four tunnels going through there. You wouldn't even have this situation going on. But somebody said, oh, no, we won't never have any more traffic. So let's not do that. Why don't you let's get your family to move out here in the 50s, Bill, and you could have been like mayor, and we could have had those things taken care of already. Come on. <laughs> It just seems that we've lost the ability to have vision on what this should look like. We're just kind of doing it by, our, by the – like we don't have a plan. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. We don't have a plan. We don't have a look at what it's supposed to look like. I mean, they build a tunnel, you know, across the water there between France and England. I mean, they're building a tunnel in New Zealand. I mean, like they're not even half the size of us. You know, and, and you look at Oregon and Washington, they have tunnels, you know, I don't understand what we're thinking. It just doesn't make sense to me. And we're and I, I don't understand. We're putting people's lives at risk. Our governments, our provincial governments, are supposed to be looking after us, the people who make the taxes. And if we're paying the taxes, then why aren't we getting dollar result for our taxes? You know that's those families have lost lives on that road and ask them what they think about the way this government and I don't mean the Liberal government or the Conservative government or the NDP. I'm just saying like the municipal governments that are in power to make these changes, they're not doing it. When you sit down with your wife for dinner, Bill, do you have these one-sided diatribes all the time? Uh, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> dinners are dinners are very short. I know. You, you know, after after you get off the show, Bill, your wife—I didn't want to tell you this on the air—but your wife phones me and she says, "What did he say?" <laughs> <laughs> We're kidding. Hey, listen, I want you to enjoy the rest of the weekend, but you're going to be back in the studio with us next week. Absolutely, and if you want me, I'll continue on today if that's okay. Well, I don't know. You can continue today, and uh, but I want you to behave yourself. We don't want you getting into any trouble or hurting yourself or anybody else. No. Okay? No. No. And but do us one other other favor, Bill. If you do something that is really really neat, if you know what I mean, if you could maybe take some selfies, we could put those on the website. 
<laughs> I would if I was better looking. But Never I'm mind. Sorry. You're I'm, just. I'm oh, a face to radio. You know that. I've heard that. that's why you're on the show. <laughs> Bill, great job. Thanks as usual, and we'll uh, we'll talk to you next week. See you in the studio next Saturday. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate it very much. Thanks, Bern. Thanks, Bill. Thank you, Bill. I just got to love your rants. They're fabulous. Thank you. You get me going, too. So, oh, Dwayne, Dwayne, help, Dwayne helps you there. He kind of feeds me stuff stuff when oh, you well, that, off the air. Yeah, that, that, that's true. That's true. I've watched that, too. So get expert mortgage information online by visiting BillyMac.com. That's Billy with an I, not a Y, Mac.com, or by calling Bill at 604-684-4663. That's 684 684 home. Billy, are you still there? I am. In our next segment, we're going to chat with Bert about some of the projects that she's working on. Wow, that'll be interesting. You two are getting along like a house on fire here, huh? Absolutely. Right. Well, we go together. back to 1994. Yeah, so, I know. It's uh, got, and, it's, and it's got something to do with a mechanical bull in Winnipeg, but we'll talk about that maybe. <laughs> it was a real bull. We keep okay, telling you. Right, it was a guys. real bull. All right. Behave yourself. <laughs> Billy, we'll talk to you next week, buddy. Thanks very much. Take it's care. Tom Lucas, along with co-host for Northcott of Remax Performance Realty, Bill Macklem on location this uh, weekend in Whistler. He is the president of Dominion Macklem Mortgages. Our producer is Dwayne Bishop. And you're listening to Radio Real Estate on Smooth and Easy, Sea Isle 650. I'm Adam Corbin, president of Instafund. For over 30 years, mortgage brokers have relied on Instafund for fast service for their clients. These days, mortgage brokers are working extra hard. With tighter lending restrictions, many of their clients can no longer rely on the banks for financing. Mortgage brokers call on Instafund to help their clients when the banks say no. Put our experience to work for you. Call 604-687-2020 to see if Instafund is the answer to your client's mortgage needs. Visit our website at instafund.com. Hi, this is Stuart Goodman, the General Sales Manager at North Vancouver Nissan, part of the Delari Automotive Group. Come and visit us in the North Shore Auto Mall and see the all-new 2016 Nissan Maxima and new Murano. Visit North Vancouver Nissan, home of the new purchase experience, in the North Shore Auto Mall or online at northvancouvernissan.ca. That's in the North Shore Auto Mall or online at northvancouvernissan.ca. When you need it done, you need the Radio Real Estate Moving Team. Hi, Ryan from Diverse Electric, offering top quality work at competitive rates. Together, we at Diverse Electric have 15 years of business and project management experience. Call us at 778-809-2532 or through our website at diverseelectricltd.ca. When you're looking for an electrical contractor who can handle any size residential or commercial project, call Diverse Electric, 778-809-2532 or through our website at diverseelectricltd.ca. How much does a polar bear weigh? Enough to break the ice. Actually, the average polar bear weighs 1,100 pounds. Here at Red Path Relocations, we're that good. With more than 30 years experience estimating, we can ensure everything is accurately accounted for and you have the best price with no hidden costs. Check us out at redpathrelocations.com or give us a call at 604-945-9910. Red Path Relocations, always ready, Always reliable. For more information, go to radiorealestateshow.ca and click on the link. Introducing Mommy Maids, a business created out of the lack of employment opportunities for single moms with flexible working hours. From residential to commercial, you can trust their insured and bonded cleaning professionals with any task. Let them clean your castle with no hassle. Go to mummymaids.com or call 604-533-4959. One, two, three, ABC. Mommy Maids, come rescue me. See I'm 650. I'm fixing a hole where the rain gets in and stops my mind from wandering. I'm filling the cracks that ran through the door and kept my mind from wandering. Well, he's fixing a hole so the rain won't come in. Perhaps they should have done that last week. It's raining out right now, and uh, Finn Jensen is out working hard. Everybody is away. Let me see. Finn, you were in Europe a little while ago. Bill Macklem is in Whistler. Uh, we speak. Well, we spoke with Ken, who's in New York City. Uh, well, every, 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 people are just everywhere, but you and me, we're still here. Hey, Billy, what's going on? Like, Wednesday's a big day around here, right? Oh, it is. Well, yeah. fall, fall starts on this Wednesday, and that you, means uh, you, the doc, still you, have time to have your plumbing and air conditioning work done. For reliable and dependable service, you want to call Finn Jensen at Gentech Mechanical Installations. He's at 778-378-2740. 
That's 778 378 27 what I'm thinking, Bill, is that we should have the Radio Real Estate Welcome Fall Party. We could Because fall actually starts Wednesday morning at 121 in the morning, and I know we'll all be up for that. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> maybe just going to bed. <laughs> or maybe just going to bed. So uh, next week will be the first show of fall. Jeez, that's scary, isn't wow. it? Wow, that scary. is so fast. Yeah, it just goes by so fast. So you go and put your muckwucks on up there in Whistler. It could start snowing any second, my friend. Yeah, I'm going to wear my galoshes, and, well, I guess you know that ad on TV with the guy with the, the plastic headgear and sucking <laughs> on a drink. I'm going to look like that guy out there, trudging <laughs> to a clear. Not only that is the bad news that fall starts on Wednesday. Daylight savings time ends on Sunday, November 1st. We go back to standard time, and that is good. I like that. Because we get the extra hour of sleep. So Fern Northcott is our brand-new co-host on the show. She's with REMAX Performance Realty. You have not only one, but you have two super-duper listings for us this morning, Fern. I certainly do. I've been busy since I've been back from Europe. Yesterday, I just listed a lot in South Surrey. It has a rental home on it. Uh, the home itself is uh, just over 900 square feet. The lot size is 95, 21 square feet. We've uh, currently got it listed at 779,900. The address is 2479-156. Please do not disturb the people that are there, but you can take a quick drive by. The second listing we've got is a one-acre Stanley Park setting. It features an executive home that was built solid in 1969, but it's been recently totally professionally renovated. It's 2578 square feet. It is listed at 2289000 It lives in Elgin Estates. The address there for a drive by is 14262 Greencrest Drive. Thank you, know, you, Tom. You know, Fern, sometimes you got to be careful of the expressions you use. There are certain areas of town you don't use the term drive-by. Oh, yeah, that's true. That's true. I well, live in Surrey. No, 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 don't say where. No, 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 no. So somebody who <laughs> oh, I love it. I live out there, too, and we love it. So if yeah, you're just, if you're just uh, thinking about uh, maybe having Fern drive you by, what's your <laughs> telephone number, for? <Fern? laughs> Uh, I can be reached either cell or text at 604-790-9066. That's 604-790-9066. And if somebody wants to go to your website? FernNorthcott.com. Thank you. And it is? It is FernNorthcott.com. Well, I'm thinking it's about time that Dwayne and I went on some sort of trip. Yeah, I'm down. <laughs> okay, I'll meet you up by the car a little later on. No, it's a different kind of trip. Everybody's away and... We just count raindrops. Well, it was a great show. Fern, thank you for being here. Well, thank you, Tom. It was you're a pleasure to be here I'm again. glad you're here. I'm glad awesome. you're here. Thank That's you. Fun. This is fun. Yeah, and uh, I guess it's our turn to go away soon. So Fern's here. Bill will be back next week. And I am. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, go have a coffee or something, will you? I need one. I tell you. It's a tough morning. <laughs> Say hi to your wife, Bill. We'll talk to you next week. Thanks so much, Tom. Thanks, buddy. It. It's the Radio you, Real Estate Show. On behalf of Bill Macklin, Fern Northcott, and Dwayne Bishop, it's Tom Lucas saying... Happy house hunting. Go buy a house or two or three, and we'll see you next week. Thank you. Bye.